Okay, I'm going to install uh, the uh, new uh, link list block uh, by Tony into my website. And we'll see how smooth this goes. I haven't done this yet, so this is an experiment. I'm going to edit my page, hopefully. I'm logged in somewhere. Okay, and I'm going to come down here, and I'm going to add block here. Link list will be my last one. All right, there it is. Let me scroll that back up. And I've got some links off screen here. I'm going to just cut, cut and paste because you need to have these ahead of time. Uh, the first one's going to be to um, Tony's blog, internet, uh, interoptics.net. He's the creator of this block. And I'm going to call this Tony's site for now. Oh, good grief. And I'm going to put um, Tony's great website. I wish I could spell website. I can almost make one, but I can't really spell it too well. And my next one is going to be to uh, Remo's blog over uh, in the German section. Not German section. Good one. Remo's blog. Uh, some great concrete live coding tutorials. Okay. And my last one's going to be over to Smart Web Projects. which is here. It's a Russian site with free blocks and custom coding. Save link. Okay. I'm going to open those links in a new window. Nice little touch there, I'll tell you. I like that. And then I'm going to exit mode. Let's see how that works. Tony's site. Yeah, beautiful. Beautiful. Love it. Remo's blog. Opens in a new window just like I wanted right to the right place and smart and that's working great for me now let's see what the code looks like in the back end see if this is going to be easy to style bring up my CSS edit which I love this program because it really shows me the um, the structure of the web page let me just clip this baby in here and let me go down here and we're going to put an x-ray mode and then check this stuff out, okay? That's how it's wrapped, div, class. There's the, uh, thing. there's my sidebar, so if I go here, I've got, that's the wrapper right there. So class of link list wrap is the, uh, is the so this should be really easy to, really easy to style. You can see everything's got a separate um, separate piece of code attached to it so they could uh, grab it, even space out the items or wrap them up individually. So this is great. This is going to be really easy to work with, I got a feeling. So let me go here and let me pull out a let me pull out my style sheet here and see what we can do. I'm not gonna show a lot of this online since it's it kind of doesn't fit in my window very well but if I go here and select this and I can create a new style right there yeah. 
Well, actually, I need to see this more than you do, so. Keep that there. Did I add that? That opens up all the windows. I'm gonna check my styles, override them. Click here. I'm gonna create a new a new style because it won't be created yet. And it looks like a something with link link list 164. Well, that's not going to work since I don't want to call it by a specific name. Uh, it looks like a class of link list. Link list wrap class. So the ID is 164. I'll strip that off and put in a class. And I should be able to some padding to that okay a little top margin on it um, change the background color to a nice orange now let's get rid of the orange how about like that and then I'm gonna add a um, curve to the corners and a shadow beautiful so I've done all that with one simple piece of code seen right here this is what it looks like I'm just gonna copy that and paste it in my existing style sheet since there's so little to do and it looks like this block is gonna be really easy to work with as far as styling since everything has separate pieces um, worth $15 I'd say uh, pick it up soon. Bye.